what's up y'all we have made it to Miami she are out here with Celsius for the few days well actually I'm only gonna be with Celsius on Thursday but we decided to fly out here just a couple days early because you know, we went flying all the way up to Miami for a day so we're staying with my friend Hannah and Zach and we're just gonna be you know chilling get a couple workouts in baby got tryouts coming up so you gotta get his workouts in we got in at like 1 o'clock 1 30 or something like that and then we took a fat nap because we did not even go to sleep last night so yeah we're just gonna be vlogging through the week we were supposed to go to Houston for a day but the Kendra concert we are we're not able we didn't get the ticket so we'll go to Houston next week but yeah I'll keep you updated I'm back <laughs> I've been are you getting naked back there I've been terrible at vlogging this trip honestly we've just been working out eating and sleeping just catching up on sleep pretty much so we haven't been doing much so there was nothing really to vlog but we are out of my friend's place and we are now checked into the Mandar Mandarin Oriental and the party is tonight so I'll do a little tour of the hotel room remove it bathroom he's cute he's cute it's a little junior suite um, a lot of space in here I'm gonna go to the little mall around the corner I think it's like a 10 minute walk and see if I can go find a new outfit at Zara because for some reason I was thinking more of like pool party I mean it is gonna be on a beach but it's more of like nighttime beach vibes so I'm not gonna be wearing like a bathing suit so more of like an outfit I'll wear in like Tulum or something because that's if you look at Joya Beach it almost looks like Tulum so I'm gonna go find another little like flowy outfit or something I can wear and then I might do a little bit of cardio just to you know get a little sweat on and then we gotta get ready and get ready to go so um yeah okay so i'm currently sweating like crazy because one i was going to zara to go find a new outfit for tonight and i had tron drop me off at the corner walked it was only like six minute walk and i get there and they've evacuated the whole like brickle uh center shopping center because there was a fire there so they had us just waiting around um while they like took care of everything. And then they were like, oh, okay, you can go back in. And this is after like 15 minutes. So we go in and then they're like, nope, we gotta evacuate you again. So I was there for like 40 minutes, just like wasting time. And then I was like, okay, fine, let me go get my nails done. I found a place, walked, could not find it. Could not find it for anything. And my thighs are chafing because it is moist out here, okay? So, came back, I'm like covered in sweat. I still only have about an hour and a half. So, I'm gonna put on some leggings and take my ass back out there. <laughs> I have nothing to wear, so. Um, one, if I got some leggings on, I don't mind the sweat, I don't mind the heat. It's like getting a little workout in, but my thighs are just, no, no. This is not, not for me. So, we're gonna pop on some leggings and then we're gonna go back out. <laughs> Couldn't decide what she wants to put on, but that's women, right? Can't decide what they want to put on. Everything I bought, that's what I'm fat right now, so nothing fits. Say what? Fat right now, so nothing fits. Babe's fat right now, so nothing fits, that's what she said.
good, baby. Let me What's see what you're What's up? We out here. It's Big Baby Bishop in the building. We just leaving the self. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Doing the thing. No co in this joint. My name's Teron. Teron. You know looking fun. Bob. <laughs> Tomorrow looking fun. Uh, let me see it. <laughs> let me see it. Hey. Yeah. Ass yeah. 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 drunk. She was going. She was going twerk it for a nigga. Now she playing shot. She want to play shot. She said, "Babe, feel me." I said, "Okay." I get out the. She get out the car. I film. Twerk a little bit. Guess what? She ain't do shit. With some McDonald's in hand, 20 nuggets, oh, two cheeseburgers. Yeah. What, it's cold? You ain't know you, King Two Times Coming. Maybe I ain't got it. You ain't got it? You ain't no, got no, it. No. It's probably in the front. Lock it up. No, I know what happened was. We drunk. I'm drunk, baby. You drunk? Yeah, I'm so so. So so? I'm drunk. We're back at the hotel. We had a cool little time. Met a few people. Went to the hookah lounge. To kill time. To see what's going on for the rest of the night. And I ain't heard back from nobody. So we got some food. I love Wipeout. And now we have to hang out. What's up, vloggy vlog? Um, I don't even remember the last time I put down the camera. Um, I think mm. we were in Miami this time. Huh? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I think we were in Miami last time I was vlogging. Yeah, well, we got back to Dallas. We were in Dallas for like two nights. That's it. Tron had his trials today, and now we are literally on the road about an hour outside of Houston. So, we'll be in Houston in about 50 minutes or so. We're headed straight to a concert, possibly. Um, his cousin and his wife invited us to a concert, but we don't know if we're going to get there in time. Burner boy. So, we'll see. Getting gas, and then we're going to sprint on over, and hopefully we'll make it. Uh, we're still going to be out here in Houston for the week. So, got some stuff to shoot, got some work to do. And, yeah. We're just going to be chilling, so. Okay, so I just got an oil change. Um because desperately needed it. But what I want to know is why or why are oil changes so expensive in Texas? Like I thought I was getting played. I went to like three different places and they were all like $90 to 100 bucks. My oil change in LA was like 40-50 bucks. My oil change in Denver was like 50 bucks. Why is it $100 in Texas? I like I don't know. Am I not going to the right place? I went to a couple places in Dallas and I went to a place out here in Houston. So I was just like, forget it. Like I went to a few places and all the prices were the same. So um, I just went and got one. But am I tripping? Is it just more expensive in Texas? I don't know. But I am at Trader Joe's. I'm going to pick us up some groceries for the week. So I'm just trying to keep it together. I'm trying to keep it together. So um, we did a lot of eating out in Miami and... Uh, Good thing is that we're at his cousin's house, who he calls his brother. We're at his cousin's house and full kitchen, everything, so we can cook and just meal prep like we normally would. So, I'm at Trader Joe's. I'm not going to take you in just because there's so many cars in the parking lot right now, so I know it's packed. But I will show you what I got when I get back to the house. I'm literally just now done grocery shopping. Obviously, you guys don't know how long it's been, but it's been about two and a half hours um, because Tehran's cousin 
lives out in the middle of nowhere. We're in Spring, Texas. And the closest Trader Joe's, 20 minutes away. The closest Costco, 20, minute away, 20 minutes away from that. Whole Foods, about 10 minutes away from that. So it just took me an hour just to get between each store. It's been two and a half hours. I'm tired, I'm done for the day. This is, this, this is it, this is all I got. Let's do a little grocery haul, show you what I got. I hit up Costco, Whole Foods, and Trader Joe's. So Costco, we got some, well, I'm gonna just go through the proteins first. So we got flank steak in here. I got a lot because me and this guy over there, he's a lot of flank. Um, this is his turkey. I don't really do ground turkey, um, but yeah. So he'll kill this in about three days, honestly. And then we got some turkey bacon eggs and then I got some tuna so I'll do tuna while he does the turkey and then the only fruit actually I got was bananas and this is pretty much gonna be like my morning pre-workout snack and then I got some seaweed these will go with my tuna I'll do an updated full day of eating and put all this stuff together but I'm just doing a little haul I got the little smash avocado from uh, Costco this is just easy especially if your avocados go bad just because these don't really go bad like I have these for a while but yeah avocado and they're just easy in the little container and then I just got some salsa some sweet pickled red onions and jalapenos um, um, bread and butter pickles I got some kimchi and then I got some potatoes and then over here is just like seasonings and stuff. Then I got some rice cauliflower. We got some romaine, arugula, cucumbers, shredded carrots. And then some Trader Joe's is always out of the rice. They're always out, but this place had nothing. So I just got like this Thai jasmine rice from Whole Foods. So we'll try that out. Black beans and some sourdough bread. So. This is my haul. This took <laughs> two and a half hours, three hours to get all this stuff just because I like to hit up my three stores. So. so, I'm up and I decided to walk to the gym today. Um, Teron left already. He got up before me and he took off. It's about 1.8 miles to get there. The walk there, I'm not worried about. It's the walk back. <laughs> just getting started it is bright out here so I went and grabbed these glasses that Celsius sent me let's see at least it'll get my cardio in you know walking there walking back I can just get there get right into my lift I'll be nice and warmed up okay let's see what I'm looking like oh I can't see myself on the camera wait what happened Oh wow, these literally completely black out the camera. <laughs> Cardio in, I'll give you guys updates. The walk says 38 minutes, um, but it's only 1.8 miles. So I'll do a little on and off jog, depending on how my knee is doing. A quick update, we are about a quarter of a mile done. I mean, <laughs> we have a quarter of a mile left and it was not bad. The thing is, is that the sun was behind the clouds majority of the time, so. I just hope it's like that on the way back. I'm literally covered in sweat and drenched and I haven't even started working out yet. Like how you walk in the gym sweating. Um, I'm not gonna record today's workout. I'm gonna hit some legs. I'm only gonna do about four or five exercises and then um, and we're gonna get the hell out of here because we got another 40 minute walk back. So um, I wanna go hard though. I wanna go heavy. That's why I'm only going with like four or five exercises. So, but. I got some workouts coming soon, so you'll see all of the workouts that I'm doing very soon. Excuse me. What's up, y'all? Is 
what's today wednesday today is wednesday the third i believe yes wednesday the third um we are headed to san diego and we are headed to vegas it is one of my best friends bachelorette weekend so today is maintenance day i need my nails done i'm gonna be wearing my natural hair so i'm just gonna pick up some more product and what else what else i need to grab a couple things because you know bachelorette weekends there's theme days we're the same color we got colored wigs that we're gonna be wearing and stuff i'm pretty much i'm all packed up there's just a couple things that i need to grab or i need to find before we fly out tomorrow teron is actually going to vegas so he's flying out to vegas because there's like a gaming event we were gonna do atlanta ebony fit weekend but i can't miss my best friend's bachelorette I just can't so He's going to go to Vegas for the gaming event. He really wanted to go that anyway. And then I'm going to meet him out there. Plus, my grandma and my grandpa just moved to Vegas anyway. So, I'm going to go see them. So, yeah. Um, I'm not working out today. I actually haven't really been working out. I'm going to give you guys an update on what's been going on. My skin has just been terrible. Um, I need like a facial or something. But eyebrows, nails, Target, mall. I'm back at the apartment. I went to get my nails done. Not the girl I usually go to. The guy wasn't that great, but whatever. Got my eyebrows waxed and I haven't gotten like my eyebrows done at a nail salon or by anybody in forever. And she waxed off the top part of my eyebrow. This is why I do them myself. I don't even know why I even went to get them done. Let me just show you what I picked up. I got Tehran this hat, got a panther on it. He has one, but he always loses his hat, so I um, got him that one. And then I got a couple graphic tees, which I'll show you. I got some earrings because my earrings, I broke one. So, picked up some new ones. Like, my best friend is like really into music, like all, all types of music. She loves music, so one of, instead of doing like matching like PJs, we're all gonna wear like some type of graphic tee with a band on it, or a group. So I chose Wu Tang. That's what I got here. And then I just bought some um, black biker shorts. There's just some little shorts to wear with it. And this is this is the wig that I'm gonna be wearing. She is bright and very blue. It's like a minty color, but it leans more blue than it does green. So I wanted to find, I was trying to figure out what outfit I wanted to wear with this, but we're gonna be going like bar hopping and stuff. So I wanted to be kind of like comfortable and you know running around the streets of san diego having drinks whatever so i wanted to keep it a little bit more casual so i was like maybe i'll get a graphic tee and turn it into a dress so i had originally got this one which is the juice world t-shirt this one is more blue like you know like way more blue than this but also it's a little bit too short to turn into a dress but i could wear like some biker shorts under it which i have some biker shorts all right when i was leaving I found this Puma shirt at JD Sport. It's like, it's basic, it's whatever, but the color, like, are you kidding me? In person, the color is literally identical. So I was thinking of wearing this, I'm gonna cut it up, like maybe cut the sleeves off. I'll wear like some really, really short shorts under it, but this is pretty long. So I do wanna like cut this up and then I was either gonna wear like some high white boots um, that I was gonna bring with me or if I wanted to be a little bit more casual I have like some Converse some high top Converse that I was gonna wear so I'm gonna cut this up and try to figure this out got a basic gray crop top I like these this brand open edit pretty good stuff then I went to Target because I needed to get a mop I'm not checking any bags anymore. Like I refuse to check a bag unless I'm gonna be gone for a long time. Cause you know, they'd be losing everything. So I got, I had to get like some containers so I can put like my hair products in it. And then I just got like some body wash, some face, uh, face wash. And then I got tons of Clorox wipes because monkey box around here, uh-uh. And then I also got some Lysol spray because we're disinfecting everything. I got a to-go pen because I always get something on my white tops, toothpaste, hairspray, um, shampoo, and then I did get some more of my Pillow Soft Curls. This is my favorite styling cream in the world. And then I got some pimple patches because this pimple just will not let me live, okay? Uh, mouthwash, and yeah. And all of that was like $80 because 
Target is just all these little things. All these little things added up to eighty-five dollars. You can get yours to go too. Okay. Hey, we done made it to what we Salt Lake City, and Babe is leaving me. <laughs> wow. We both had a layover, so we're both here for about an hour. I'm going to San Diego, and he's going to Vegas. So our flights leave literally like 20 minutes apart. So we flew here together, and now we're we haven't been apart in forever. How <laughs> long? We went somewhere. I forgot where. He's leaving. I'm out. I'm leaving. You're leaving me. I'm 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 gone. We're gonna be separated for three whole days. <laughs> Damn, just three. All right, I made it to San Diego. I'm calling my Uber now. I'm the first one to get in. Everybody's flights were delayed, so I'm on back off and then go to Costco to pick up some drinks and stuff for the group. So yeah, just me hanging out by myself. <laughs> We are officially inside the Airbnb. It's really cute. Um, they still have to come clean because I'm not supposed to be here yet, uh, but I can do a quick tour. Um, here we go. So where we're staying is literally like right on the beach. Ooh, I can go for a morning jog. There's like a little trail area. Let me show you. I'm currently just waiting for my Uber who is three minutes away and then we're gonna go get some food at Costco. I'm in charge of everything since I'm the only one here. Just made it back to the Airbnb. I believe they're still cleaning, like they're finishing up right now, but I unloaded all the stuff. So, got the groceries here. So, when they're done, I'm gonna drag it on all the stairs, so. And then I'll show you everything that I actually bought, so. So they're still in there cleaning, just doing some last minute stuff. So I'm just out on the balcony, just relaxing. I just need to sit down for a second anyway, because one, we went to sleep super late, got up, got a flight, had a layover, hopped on the next flight. As soon as I landed, went straight to Costco. So I've been moving literally nonstop and it is 3 p.m. So I'm just gonna relax. I actually need a couple stuff from like, I need to order from like a regular grocery store. Just like, I wanna get some onions and bell peppers, but you know at Costco, they got like the, I didn't need that much. So I'm gonna place an order here for DoorDash for a regular grocery store just to come bring some stuff. And then 
um, when they're finished, I'm gonna go and load up and make the refrigerator all cute, cabinets all cute, you know? So. Oh! <laughs> it's okay. Damn it. <laughs> Here's the bride to be. <laughs> That's my best friend. Okay, so we got the breads, the croissant, some little mini cookies. Patron? Yeah, we could do Patron. Got chips, some mangoes, coconut almond things, chickpeas, some other chips. Got some potatoes over there. Brandy has the alcohol. And then stocked up the fridge. Got some eggs, gonna make some bacon. I'm gonna make a cucumber avocado salad. Um, some bananas, some soup, guacamole, lots of limes for all the tequila, tons of fruit, <laughs> hummus, artichoke dip, salsa. I accidentally grabbed the freaking little water bottles, which I'm pissed, but whatever. <laughs> We're gonna be chugging those. We're gonna drink like little like 20 of those a day. Um, got some little margaritas just in case we don't like, you know, just to have with the hard liquor. And some body armors. We need all of the electrolytes we can possibly get. Avocados, turkey bacon. And then here I just grabbed a couple salads. So just like a chicken style salad and a broccoli salad. FaceTime. Say hi to the vlog. <laughs> We're taking a shot together. Yeah, move the bread. <laughs> Move all, oh, the, all the croissants. All the croissants. <laughs> Got all the bread. Baby's over there. You can pop over here. <coughs> Cheers. You can come hang out here too if you want. <laughs> the girl. Cheers, baby. Cheers. Cheers to Brandy. Get married. Messy. She be a messy. <laughs> okay, we've been drinking all day. All day. But now we're gonna switch and put on some like little band tees. Cause Brandy loves old school music. She loves the rock band. She loves the rap band. So we're gonna put on some tees and get comfy. One, my belly is like, oh my gosh, let me show y'all how bloated I am right now. This is this I've had dairy like twice today, and this is not okay. Look at my belly. Oh, 
Look at my belly. Oh, it hurts so bad. It hurts so bad. It's like so hard. Oh my gosh. Oh, baby. All right. End of day one. Lose my voice. I had a lot of alcohol today. I am tapping out. I'm done. Um, there's what? There's eight of us here. One already fell asleep. He tapped out. And the other girls are out there still talking. Bree's in the shower. So we're starting to wind down. The conversations are getting serious. Um, but I need to rest. I need a full. I need to wake up. Refresh. Rejuvenate. We are back. I don't think I've even spoken today. Um, it is day two. We are, um, we've already got up. I made breakfast, as you can see. I made breakfast for everybody. We went to the beach. We've been drinking, of course. But now we're getting ready to get the night going. So, um, doing my hair. I took some pictures at the beach too for Celsius, of course, you know. We're just getting ready to go out. So we're gonna get some food, like dinner. And then I guess there's a place we're supposed to go to. It's like, like cabanas and stuff next to a pool and they got like a DJ and stuff, but we'll still be like dressed up. I'm redoing my hair and then I'm gonna get ready, put on a little bit of makeup. It feels amazing out here. So I don't have to worry about like sweating my makeup off, which is good. I've been in the hot Texas weather for too long but it's literally like 80 degrees out here and it's so perfect um, i'm losing my voice i'm really tired it's only like it has even been like it's only day two and probably like 24 hours since i started drinking if that and i'm beat i am i'm tired you guys are still out of here Say hello, Brianna. Say hello, oh, lovely. No. Say hi to the camera. Jesus. Coming around this way. Can I get a bacon bit? Brittany! Look at, we bought this right now like a thousand dollars. It was so spicy and regular. She's stupid and normal. She's so cute, isn't she? Cheers! Hi! We love you! You're a dirty whore and we love you. You're a dirty whore and we love you. We're so glad someone would say thank you. Obviously, I love all of you very much and you all are very important to me. And I don't know what else to say, but you guys are fucking awesome and I hope that you feel, you know how much I love you. Oh my god. Don't listen to the guys. So we're all drunk. 
<laughs> We're all drunk. Everybody's out. Yeah. We're chilling at a freaking Jack in the Box right now. <laughs> um, because we listened to a guy who was falling asleep at the table. And he said, let's go to a gay, a gay club, a gay bar, which we're all down for. We love it. Love it. We love the gays. Um, but we're like in the middle of nowhere. It's dead out here. It's empty. Um, so, oh, my button. See, my boobs are about to pop out. <laughs> we're, somebody's going to get a full show. She, she was like, oh, you guys are going to the same club as this, right? It was a girl. Yeah, she was like, hey, we're going here afterwards. Where was that? Well, she said the name. She told Brandy. We're out here dealing with crazy bones. Yeah. <laughs> He said That's he about to smack her. Why well, we leave? Well, we're literally in an area we shouldn't be in. Well, where are we doing? Where, where's Uber? Yeah, where's Uber? Where's Uber? barely hanging on here um i have been hungover all day today i literally just got up and got ready everybody was way ready before me they're in there drinking and i'm struggling struggling so um it's the last day and then i head to vegas tomorrow um let me show you the outfit today is a wig day i got this blue one with a matching um we wanted to, we were supposed to find like outfits to match the wigs but you know you guys i already mentioned this oh this is what it looks like and i cut the sleeves off Thanks under here. You see, and then I just have on the forces. So this is what I'm wearing. I'm gonna be rocking sunglasses all day, but we're gonna get there. struggling out here we're struggling Brie are you struggling or are you okay no I'm okay I'm good. okay I'm good. I'm good I'm not okay but you know we're struggling along my wig looks crazy but you know no I'm good I'm fucking You're good, good dude. Yeah. yeah I'm good <laughs> Huh? Oh, oh, it's a video. Oh, it's a video. Oh, it's a video. <laughs> so sweet. Ah! <laughs> you did. Hi. <sighs> Bri and I tapped out. Huh? I'm talking to the vlog. We uh, just got back to the Airbnb. We're going to see if we're going to make it out again. We don't know. But one, four, one, one. It's just open. Why was it just open? No one. Because they left out after us. We'll start in the bedroom. Bedroom one. I need you to stay here and watch the hallway. Okay. This is how the ops do it. Okay. I'm on lookout. <laughs> Give it a Back. Let's make our way down. <laughs> okay, making our way down the hallway. Bathroom. We good? No, hold on. Closets, taking the closets. Check our bedroom. Y'all, the week had to go. <laughs> had to go. Um, I got me some leftover Thai food. Got some water. And we're about to watch some Netflix or something. Um, it's so cold and cozy in here right now. Oh my gosh. 
Let me show you my plate though. My plate. Amazing. Um, I'll let y'all know if I make it out. If not, I will see y'all in Vegas. Y'all, it's super dark outside right now. Uh, well, it's it's nighttime. So, <laughs> I am officially in Vegas. And I got here in this morning. Tron picked me up. I was dead tired. We got food. And I knocked out. I told him, let me sleep for like 30 more minutes. Five hours later. So, um, I caught up on some sleep. I feel much better. We ate. His friend and his wife cooked us like a lovely dinner. So, or early. It was like a late lunch, early dinner. So, um, we've just been hanging out, watched a movie. And now we're just gonna go roam the Vegas streets, you know? I got on just this white top with some black biker shorts and some thigh hot boots. And there's my babe. What's up? Thank you, honey. Yeah, so we're just gonna go wander around and see where the night takes us. No plans. Maybe get some drinks and some food and then we'll go from there. So grab that thing, baby. Okay, I'm back. It's the next day. Now I'm back at my grandma's. I'm picking her up right now so we can go get some breakfast. Taking this little lady out because her birthday's in a couple days anyway. So I'll just take her out to breakfast, you know? Um, so I'm waiting on her right now in the car. I'm driving this car, this rental that Tron got. It's like, I don't, I forgot what it's called. It's like the competitor of Tesla. And, um,. It's hard getting used to driving this because when you pull off the gas, like, you know, usually cars cruise to slow down. No, no, no. When you pull your foot off the gas, it literally just comes to a dead stop. So you have to, like, ease down, like, ease off. And so, yeah, I've been jerking and popping around. Um, but <laughs> I think I got it. But yeah, that was just, just random. I'd just be talking. Um, I, just, I knew I should text her. There she is. <laughs> <laughs> she, uh, you didn't know it was me. Uh -uh, you got the glasses on. Oh. <laughs> oh. What you want? Oh shh. Well. Uh, <laughs> okay. he, he had to work. Mm. Oh. Okay, you'll have food for later. This is beautiful though. Dig on in, girl. It's, it's the, uh, the crunchy potatoes. It's potatoes. Country potatoes. Mm. Did, yep. there's, some, there's some salt and pepper right here. So you need yeah, it. definitely need that. Now it's time to pack it up for the last time. At least for the next three weeks. 